what does COI stand for and why is it a big deal? Right. I love this policy. So COI stands for conflict of interest policy. And really what that means is that you have board members, you have key employees in any organization, not just nonprofit organizations that are in positions to influence decisions. And those might be decisions about who to do business with, who to give a contract to, et cetera. Board members, again, across the board, not unique to nonprofits, they have a fiduciary responsibility. And one of the meanings of fiduciary responsibility is that they have a responsibility to do what's best for the organization. Mm -hmm. So I kind of like to compare it to parents, guardians, and minor children, right? Wow. So your parents and your guardians <laughs> have a responsibility to do what's in the best interest of the minor children. And in this case, an organization, whether profit or nonprofit, is analogous to that, those minor children. And board members have to do what's right by the children, in my example. I and so love that. Part of what that means is that they have to be cautious about doing business with people, whether board or key employees, who are in a position to leverage decision-making. They have to be very, very cautious about that. 